Most of us. Nepal. Nepal. Kommt mir jetzt hoch oder soll ich anfangen? Soll ich anfangen oder? Which part in India? The people in India. Some are from the kind of all over. part of India, some are from eastern part, some from south and some from north. So it's all over India. <laughs> it's a presentation of India. Representation. Okay. Okay, I think everybody's here, so we can start. First of all, I would like to welcome you here in the Black Forest. Welcome, my name is Amjad. Thank you, Amjad Khan. <laughs> and today I will tell you some information how we do the cuckoo clocks here in the Black Forest. So let's start from the beginning, from the first clock and this one here. As you see, it's a simple clock made all of wood. Mechanism inside, it's a three wooden wood. And this was made around 1640. That was the first clock here in the Black Forest. At this time, they use only one hand for the hour and no hand for the minutes. And if you want to know the time exactly, you just have to guess. <laughs> for the weights, they use two stone like this here. Mm -hmm. And this one, you have to wind it up every 12 hours, just one time. Like this way. Mm -hmm. Of course, it has no sound, no cuckoo. That was the first clock here in the back. After that, the second generation of the clocks become like here. Mm. It already has two real hands and two real weights. Mm. Around 1760, that was the first time they used the cuckoo sound in this kind of clock. <laughs> <laughs> So let's have a look at this one here. This one is the biggest cuckoo clock in the shop. It costs more than 4,000 euros. That's why it's still here. <laughs> the reason it costs a lot of money is because it has a lot of carving in the wood, as you see. A clock like this takes between 6 to 8 weeks with 4 people at least working on the carving. That's why it costs yeah. lots of money. Now let's see something different a little bit. This one here, it's called the mother-in-law clock or sesuma. Is it the same in India? No. 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 Same in Nepal? <laughs> yeah, it's in Nepal. Now the roles have been given. Now the wife plays the role of mother. Okay. Right? Wow. It's international. <laughs> so I show you how we're making the clocks. This is the wood we're using. It's called lime wood. It's soft wood to carve. But before we start carving in the wood, we have to wait at least four years until the wood getting dry. Mm. Yeah. After that, we take a piece of wood like this, we put stencil of metal in the top, and then we spray it with the color to be like this here. And only the first step by machine, we cut the face out of the wood to be like this way. Mm -hmm. Then we're starting with handmade working, carving the face to be in the end like that. And sometimes we add some animals in the black forest, like the rabbit on the side here, the bird. So this is only the face. Now we put the clock together. We have the body of the clock. And then comes the face. And the last piece is the top of the clock. It's easy, right? <laughs> All right, inside the clocks, we are talking about the original mechanism cuckoo clocks, not the battery. Here we have four different types of mechanisms. Like this one and this one, they are one day winding clock. And this one and this one, they are weekly winding clock. So we have two different kinds of cuckoo clocks, one day and one week. How do you know the difference? 
It's very simple. You have to look for the size of the weight. We have two different sizes here. No, that's the weight, not the bin bar. Mm -hmm. If you see a small weight like this one, that means... One day, one day. One day, one day. Yeah. Small one is one day, and the bigger one, of course, one week. One and any original cuckoo clock must have two weights. Mm -hmm. The first weight for the machine inside, and the second weight for the cuckoo. Some clocks they have a three weight. Three weights means cuckoo and music. Two weights only a cuckoo sound, three cuckoo and then music play. To wind your clock it's something easy. You take the chain and just pull it like this once every day or once every week. Happy dead body to Chile. Now Same. I have to surprise you the sound of the cuckoo, how it comes. It just two bubbles like this. <laughs> it's not a real cuckoo. <laughs> That's for a big clock and for the baby cuckoo clock. You have a baby cuckoo sound as well. <laughs> uh, what are those exactly? This is a competition between a nylon and cotton, so it's not easy to break. It's like a whistle with the hair. It's like a whistle, okay. Yeah. So it's very, very, very important. Please, if you like to have a cuckoo clock, Pay attention, before you hang your clock in the wall, you have to open it from the back. You will find it inside like this. You see in the two bottles, there is two red flaps in the top. This must be removed. Both of them. That's very important. If you forgot to remove this, no sound will come in your clock. So just plug the bottles for your transportation. Otherwise, the cuckoo will keep talking to you all the way. <laughs> <laughs> So again, please, open from the back, some people call and say the clock doesn't work, but actually they forgot to remove this. So now let's see how it's working from inside. After the cuckoo finished, see the music box starting to play, and then see the dancers here in the front. good to know also that all the clocks having a switch on the side here in case you are sleeping at night and you don't want to hear the sound you can easily turn it off the clock still running but no sound anymore all right now please follow me over there i show you more of the clocks Okay. Are you sure the guys in the back can see? No, not sure. That small people have to push. They come in the front. Come on. Maybe Sasuma in the front. He also nice. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. We have here more than 120 different cuckoo blocks. And now let's have a special one. Have a look for the special ones. We start with this one here. This one is the most special cuckoo clock in the shop because it's the only one that has a real water inside. First you see the cuckoo comes in the lock. After it's finished, the musician starting to play, the dancer on the side here, and the dancer in the top, and then have a look here. Oh. That's a real water turning the water. And this one has a pump inside. The pump is powered by battery. But the battery you don't need to recharge it because it's powered by solar panel in the both side of the room. This one here, it's a romantic one. <laughs> You 
see first the cooker in the top, the dancers after starting to move, and then you see the guy climbing up for the lady. <coughs> The father, <laughs> or the husband, we don't know. <laughs> and after marriage, the last one I'm going to show you is a romantic cuckoo clock. It's called the honeymoon Any honeymoon couple here? <laughs> yeah, you don't need to go. <laughs> well, we offer you two years guarantee for the mechanical cuckoo clock. Batteries operated has no any international guarantee. And we have service station in some countries in the world. In India, we have two service station, Bombay and Bangalore. Uh, any country else? Nibal, no. Why in Bombay? Why in Bombay? No, I don't know that. Bombay, <laughs> Bangalore. Price is all in euros and including the tax. So if you spend something like 50 euros or more, you get 15% tax off direct here in the shop. Also, we can ship it to you if you like, it's an option. Shipping costs depend on the weight of the goods. It's come door to door, covered by insurance. You can use your credit card, traveler checks, US dollar, English pound as well. Downstairs is a self-service restaurant. Thanks a lot for your listening and have a nice time.